Ah, what an exciting morning, guys. The energy is high. I gotta get my coffee real quick. The patch is now live. So in this video, we're gonna talk about the 10 best stadiums that you can get today. Now, of course, there's so many. Mine is now up for you to download if you want. Uh, just m.frisk is the PSN, so you can get .crewu. This search function's uh, gonna be great. And, you know, over on Twitter, if you see a good stadium, you know, send it to me, m.frisk. If you've made a good stadium, send it to me. Cause I want to be able to shine a spotlight on, on the amazing stadiums that exist but these are 10 that i've seen that i have right now that i've downloaded that i think are are, are amazing so let's let's get into it first up we've got burrito mountain uh, this was uploaded by clutch you know he did an incredible job He's got an airport here. I mean, this giant bridge across. I mean, this is a very interesting little field. Uh, I think he did an amazing job. I mean, this is one that, you know, I haven't played on yet. I'm going to do, you know, maybe a road to the show video here, but a lot of attention to detail. He's got this like little popcorn stand over here. Um, Burrito Mountain, nonetheless, get it in the vault. Uh, by Clutch Silver. All right, this next one's called The Hideout. This one's by Kasabe. So if you want to find it in the vault, um, go, you know, go check out Kasabe. He's got a lot of stadiums that we're going to talk about in this list. Um, but he made this stadium for Scuffy, uh, for his, you know, bronze bandits, uh, you know, his series. This is really cool. He has rocks all the way around, uh, except for in the back to kind of preserve memory. There's still 85% left. So if you want to maybe jump in and make some changes, there, there's some room for that. Um, he's got this, you know, little little trolley thing that's moving on on the train deep uh, and right uh, or is that center? Yeah, center behind, you know, this giant scoreboard. But uh, this rock structure back here, I mean, this is a pretty straightforward, you know, field here seats 43,000 people. Uh, the hideout. Uh, make sure you get this one. OK, for the third one, another Kasabe Stadium. This is Steel Stadium. Uh, we did talk about this in the video. Um, but you want to check this one out. This one's modeled after the old backyard baseball. Um, he did an incredible job. This one, a lot of attention to detail. He's got the little trees that he's been, you know, kind of made shrubs around the fence. Uh, this pool out here uh, in left and right uh, with the slides. Of course, he's got the iconic shed uh, and the buildings here. He's, you know, made it in a neighborhood and in... I think the other part of it too, we looked in the back. This is what he did. He put some stands here. So there is some seating, 84. Got the gym back here. Feels very like school vibe. These look like schoolhouse. I thought he did a great job with this. Uh, Got to go check it out. Once again, Steel Stadium by Kasabe in the vault. Okay, at number four, this is Comfort of Home Field uh, by my guy Swami. Now he made the most wholesome field that I, I mean this is totally swami you know i feel like he modeled this after his hometown look at this thing it feels like you're you know you're just right in the neighborhood right like comfort of home field like he, the name too fits it so much you know you can see football field over here tennis courts this looks like a nice little school this seats 136 people uh you know it was just with these little bleachers over here these two bleachers and i think on both sides uh, make sure you get the comfort of home field by swami okay at five patterson park by paul sinney uh, over on Twitch. I, I'm pretty sure he made this all himself, but he did a really good job. Uh, you know, I mean, this has some seating, 7,000, a seat 7,000, but you know, he, he did some really creative things that, you know, he used buildings uh, to kind of sandwich in the environment. Um, he's got stands here. He's got a double deck, but um, he used this long building as you know to kind of sandwich in the space. This I, this part kind of blew me away because you don't really see it until you get in. Home plate, there isn't stands. It's like a little plaza area, and so um, it's actually kind of cool. It reminds me of college. Like it's got like a, a college baseball vibe. You go in, you see the statue. Amazing view here with the bridge, and you come in, and then boom, you're in a plaza right behind the field. And you can find your seat on both sides. Um, I don't actually know how you get to these seats over here. Maybe you got to go from a different angle. But, you know, I, this is a very well done field. You know, Paul Cini on Twitch. So uh, go check out Patterson Park uh, by Paul Cini. All right. At number six, Bear Den Stadium by my guy Huggy. 
Now, Huggy is, I mean, he's quickly risen the ranks to being one of the best stadium creators, um, you know, I've seen. And, you know, he's been making a lot of different stadiums uh, for, for different uh, YouTubers and streamers. So you're going to see him on this list a couple times too. But look at this thing. Very, I mean, he put a lot of attention to detail in this. Pretty good concourse that he made here. This is not easy to make right here. Um, he kind of used the buildings here to kind of make it feel like it's pretty sandwiched in. Uh, reason why it's called Bear Den, he's got this bear statue on this rock, a pool and kind of like a little plaza complex area. Um, this is a nice little 32,000 seating stadium you know could be good for double AA, a triple a be sure to go check out bear den by huggy at number seven anaheim stadium and this is part of the classic stadium series you know that some lady named ruth over at reddit is recreating and, and so to get this into the vault the name's actually uh siever sheets 15 um but he's done a really good job at re recreating anaheim stadium there isn't that much fluff here though guys right like like 69 percent um, of memory is used. So there's a lot that you could add to this if you wanted to pick it up and download it. But he really focused on trying to find a way to make this as realistic as possible. Um, and if you look at the real thing, like he did a great job. I even like here how he sunk the cars down underneath the concourse here. Um, Anaheim Stadium, the historic Anaheim Stadium uh, by Seaver Sheets 15 in the vault. All right, we got another Kasabe Stadium here at number eight. This is the Sandlot. Uh, and, you know, we were having a conversation on Twitter uh, and someone was like, hey, you know, can someone make the Sandlot field? He, of course, had to fill in a little bit of the blanks here to, to really make it work. But look, this guy made a legit town, like a little town. You know, he, of course, used a lot of trees to kind of box it, box it in. He put a house here or a couple of houses over here to make it look like a house. Uh, and then he put these trees or these bushes here. And he basically said, you know, anything hit over the left field fence is property of the beast. I thought he did, you know, an incredible job. I'll be playing a few Road to the Show games here. Go check out the Sandlot by Kasabe uh, in the vault. At number nine, another stadium by Huggy. This time it's Thai Guy 711 Stadium. Another really good design stadium. Used a concrete floor here, which I thought was interesting. A uh, lot of activity, like an entire theme park out here. Uh, in right field. He built this nice little rock structure back here. Put the sign up here, has a water feature. And look how look how low he, he uses the trees as bushes. Like that's a little hack that I think uh, is really cool. You got this plaza out here. Um, of course the batter's eye and there's, you know, some seating up here, um, but he kind of cut off some of that seating, you know, with, with these couple buildings. And so um, randomly a dinosaur here, like this feature here. And I thought this was cool, the turnstiles to get into the stadium and you've got these gates here. But back here, it's like this entire pier, uh, you know, where there's an entire, you know, there's basically a roller coaster and Ferris wheel. This is, you know, a good AAA stadium, 37,000. Uh, this works online uh, or it works uh, for your franchise. So uh, Huggy, good job again. This is Thai Guy 711 Stadium. All right, and this last one, number 10, Let It Fly Field by Finn for the win. Uh, you know, we covered this in the Road to Show video, but I had to put it on this list specifically because he did a great job with this little stadium. And when I say little, I mean little. This is probably the smallest stadium I've seen. You can't use it online, um, but it looks like he just, you know, for his road to the show or franchise, he just tried to make a stadium where he could just hit nukes. And so it's 297 basically to right and left, and then it's like 350 to center. Fly balls fly out into upper deck. I mean, I've seen balls that you have kid off these rocks here. Uh, so shout out to Finn. These are 10 stadiums that you got to get today. Um, I'm trying to look for more stadiums, you know, online. So uh, on Twitter, which is uh, my Twitter is m.frisk. Uh, just tag me. Let me know if you see something or if you create something you think is really cool. Because um, I want to make more videos like this. Uh, and I want to feature more amazing videos and creators. Thanks for tuning into this one. And until the next one, we'll see ya. Peace.